You've been busy. I have. I have been busy. I've, you know, been doing all the press for Hollywood Darlings, which um, the finale airs this Wednesday. Yeah. Um, we had eight episodes of that, which was super fun. I mean, and we've gotten a great response. It was, it was great. And then still shooting, you know, season three of Fuller House. We've been plugging away at that. We have a couple weeks off right now, but it's, yeah, it's, my schedule has been full, and I like it. That How way. often do you say to yourself, I can't believe we're still shooting the show? I mean, you had legendary time on Full House, now you're shooting third season of Fuller yeah. House. It just doesn't usually happen like that. It doesn't usually happen like that, and I, I definitely, probably at least once a week, I just kind of look around and I'm like, Wow, I can't believe I'm getting to do this again. It's it's really cool. Were you worried how people would receive it early on because you're you're remaking something that was so incredible? Were you, was there well, ever that I think, sense of I mean, because our show is yes, it's based on the original characters, but we're not trying to recreate Full House. Yeah. We're doing those characters updated. I think that gave us a little bit of of, of some leeway. It wasn't like we were trying to recreate exactly what the show was before. Yeah. Um, and, you know, we've had so much fun with it, but we wanted the fans to really feel that same sense of familiarity and, and sort of, you know, television comfort food that they did with the first one. And I think that we've really achieved that and also with some really fun humor. And, I mean, we, our shows are like, you know, circuses. I mean, we have stunts <laughs> right. and, you know, special effects and all kinds of stuff that, you know, we rarely did on the original show. So it's really fun. You, we have a good time. Yeah, you obviously are doing something, right? Season three, yeah. like we said. What are we going to see? I know you can't tell me much. Can't but tell you much. Where, where do things pick up? Oh, well, guest stars? I mean, something? Uh, I can't. You hate this I, question. I hate this question. I hate this question before Netflix is like, and now you can go. Because it's <laughs> right, like, right. Uh, and I'm always afraid, like, I'm going to say something. I'm going to say something. Netflix is going to be like, Get the email. And then I keep poking yeah. and prodding. Yeah, keep poking and prodding. Yeah. Um, no, I mean, you know, there's still all of the the characters that everyone has kind of grown to love over the past three seasons. Fernando's still there. Jimmy Gibbler's there. Um, you know, uh, uh, Matt and Steve. Sure. Um, I mean, our our cast seems to keep growing as we do with Full and Fuller House. Like it just literally keeps getting fuller. Um, but yeah, I think uh, you know people are going to have a lot of fun with some of the things that we do this season. There's some unexpected things. It's obvious when I see you guys go to premieres, interview you, you guys are so close yeah. as a cast. Yeah. Um, what do they all mean to you? I mean, these are people that I've known now since I was, you know, four, almost five years old. I mean, I've known them for 31 years of my life. I think it's kind of hard to put into words what they mean because yeah. they are, they really are my family. I mean, other than like my parents and, you know, my actual legitimate family, I, there's nobody else in my life that I've known longer than these people and that have, you know, been with me through everything, all of us. I mean, we've been through, you know, births and deaths and marriages and divorces and everything together. Um, I think it's kind of hard to put into words just how close of a family we really are. My life has been pretty good and easy and happy right now. Um, my kids are always yeah. my, I mean, they're not a distraction. They're just sort of my main focus all the time. So anything I get to do with them, I mean, I've been helping them with their talent shows and getting their costumes ready and their drama club performances and all that. So that's exciting, just like mom stuff for me that I love to do. <laughs>